Following the ban on commercial, commercial motorcycles, also known as Okada, in six local government areas of Lagos State, over 2,000 seized motorcycles have been crushed. The state government says it is a signal that it is serious about the ban on Okada, while assuring the residents that alternative means of transportation will be provided. Senior correspondent Ivy Kano reports. Representatives of the state government are on the ground for this exercise. In groups, the driver of the crusher picked and dumped motorcycles into the metal crusher. The state government said this would be a continuous activity if people insist on violating the restriction on the use of motorcycles in specified areas. I'm happy you have seen the way they have been crushed so that uh, anybody who has any doubt that these Okadas may return to town, uh, the research doubt is not going to be uh, realistic. Uh, this is what is going to be happening to them. In the first quarter of this year, about 5,000 have been crushed like this, and then the operation is going to continue. For the enforcement officers, it's been days of hard work, given how large some of the local government areas are. Most of them were arrested in the last three days because it's been a continuous uh, enforcement since uh, 12 midnight of uh, 31st of May 2022. We should know that in those six local government, we have a lot of LCDAs. So those LCDAs are being affected as well. So this is where we have all worked together with the DPOs, with the area commanders, and we can have this number available this morning for crushing. Like in the last three days, we've arrested some people, we've charged them to call, they are already in you know, in correctional centers. The Commissioner for Transport says no cause for alarm as there are alternative means of transportation. We've increased the number of uh, first and last mile buses on our routes. Um, the lag ride, uh, remember that we commissioned a thousand lag rides, there are about 200 on the road right now and we're ramping that up over the next com uh, coming week. We've increased the number of boats on our waterways and the um, BLTs, uh, we've increased the capacity just to make sure that people have alternatives. Two days ago, the enforcement of the ban on motorcycles in six local government areas took effect. Government says it is not unmindful of the challenges this may pose, but insists that security of life, which is being threatened by activities of some riders, is more important. Ivy Kano, TVC News, Lagos.